Hi, I'm Peggy Farron. I'm going to show you how to achieve the silky water effect in broad daylight with no neutral density filter. The first step is to find a spot with moving water. Put your camera on a tripod. Put your camera in continuous drive mode. Manual mode, now metered to zero. Now my settings were ISO 100, shutter speed 100, and F8, but yours might be different. Um, focus about a third of the way in for landscape photography and then put your lens in manual focus. Take about 30 pictures. Now I'm just in continuous drive mode, click, 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 but I have a memory card that's a little slow so I could only take about 15 pictures before it gave me the busy. You see the light is, it's, it's, bur it's writing to the card. So I'll wait for this to finish and I'll take 15 more pictures. Then I'm going to move over to Photoshop. Okay, from here, I put the pictures on the computer and I'm in Photoshop. So I'm gonna go to File, Open, and I'm going to find all the pictures. So here they are. So I'm going to select them all and open. Now I shoot in RAW, so Adobe Camera RAW will open first. If you shoot in JPEG, they'll just automatically open. But I'm just going to uh, click the first one and do Control A on my Windows machine, con Command A on a Mac to select them all. Did it work? And then open images down here. Okay, so uh, it's 30 images, so it, it might take a minute. You can see as they're opening that it looks like the water is moving. Since my camera was on a tripod, nothing's moving but the water. So once your pictures are all loaded into Photoshop, you want to go up to um, File, Scripts, load files into stack you're going to add your open files and then click on both of these attempt to automatically align source images and create smart object after loading loading layers and click ok all right now this is going to take a minute so be patient but you see like it looks like the water's moving again um, photoshop is stacking the images once it's finished, go up to Layer, Smart Objects, Stack Mode, and then you want to go to Mean. Okay? Smart Objects, Stack Mode, Mean. Click on that. It's going to work again. And here's where the magic's going to happen. Photoshop is going to blend all of these images together. Now it may take a while, so be patient depending on the speed of your computer. And voila! When it's finished, you have the silky water effect in broad daylight without using a neutral density filter with my shutter speed at, what, what did I say? It was one one hundredth of a second. Now if I had taken even more pictures, this would have been even silkier. As far as I know, there's no limit on the amount of pictures you could take. So I could have blended maybe 60 images and would have come up with an even silkier look. I'm Peggy Farron with understandphotography.com. Thanks for watching. Get up!